A controversial federal fingerprinting initiative is now active in Massachusetts and in states across the country. Immigration and Customs Enforcement, or ICE, puts secure communities into effect on May 15th. Here's how it works. Currently, when someone is arrested, his or her fingerprints are shared with the FBI under secure communities. Those prints are now also shared with ICE, which then could remove illegal aliens from the U.S. The program targets only criminal aliens and repeat immigration law violators. According to ICE spokesman Ross Feinstein, 55% of those removed from the U.S. in 2011 were convicted criminals. ICE removed a record number of criminal aliens in 2011. To date, Secure Communities has helped ICE remove more than 135,000 convicted criminal aliens, said Feinstein, including more than 49,000 convicted of major violent offenses like murder, rape, and the sexual abuse of children. To stem opposition from immigrant groups and others, ICE officials are taking steps to ensure that no aliens are deported for minor traffic violations and that enforcement protects witnesses and victims of domestic violence. Approximately 95% of the 179,000 removals generated through secure communities clearly fell within one of ICE's enforcement priorities, said Feinstein.